Hi everyone! It's Friday. Um, long time no see. <laughs> or here. <laughs> um, gosh, life's been tough. <laughs> uh, life's been busy, I guess. Um, but I've been creating. Believe me, I have. <laughs> um, um, so today I wanted to um, share some cards that I've made for Whimsical Design. I'm a um, part of their design team and um, thanks Stephanie um, she's a great person to work for I love her stamps they're they're awesome they're the best quality stamps you could could get um, so it's been a while since I've shown some of my cards and if you follow me on my blog you you know, you'll be able to see all of these. I've, you know, we post every Wednesday for a Wednesday challenge. Um, so if you go to whimsicaldesigns.com, I believe, or is it Stephanie? Well, I'll have all the links down below if you're interested in visiting us over at Whimsical Designs. Down below in the little, you know, information box down there. Um... So I've been posting, I just haven't been filming. <laughs> um, so I'm here today to show you my cards. Um, some of them are not in order. Um, some of them are. Um, I've given s some cards away, so I, you know, I have, um, I've been so bad at filming. Um, but I'm going to get back in the swing of things and try to um, film my cards as I go, I guess. Um... So my recent card that I just made um, for Whimsical, uh, the challenge last week was Smell the Flowers, and um, the sponsor was um, Saturated Canary, and we were um, offered um, an image to work with um, and to promote, um, and this is my card that I made for the challenge. Um, she's washy um, girl. Um, don't ask me why I picked this. <laughs> when I picked her, I wasn't even thinking about the challenge. And then when I pulled her up and printed her out, I I was like, what? <laughs> but I made it work, and I just love her to death. And um, I love the image. The image is so adorable. Um, she also had this little saying that goes with her. Um, Roses are red, violets are blue, washi tape, I couldn't live without you. And I know how some of us are with washi. I can't... I love washi. You know, I, I probably haven't used enough of it. <laughs> I've used a few of my washi, and um, I have it in a container that is just, I just love to look at, I guess. <laughs> um, so I used some some flower paper, and I don't remember the um, paper collection, but if you really want to know, I will go and um, search and let you know, or you could visit my blog. Either way. Um, so I colored it up with my Copics. I punched out um, the little poem here with my Stampin' Up! tag punch. I used Stephanie's um, stamp, Oh Happy Day. I used some flowers that I got from Lauren from my mixed media tag swap that Bona hosted at my scrap room. Um... I added a flower. It's a it's a satin flower that I've had forever in my stash. Um, a flat back pearl, um, some washi, or I think this is decorative tape, but you know similar to washi. And I thought it just added a little flowery touch to the card. And I pop dot her, and also the the saying here. And that's my first card. Oh, oh, I'm sorry. And then I used um, an EK Success punch, uh, scallop punch on the side here. So I really like how that turned out. Uh, next card is a button cupcake. 
And that image came from our sponsor from the week before. Um, it's from Limited Runs Digital Stamps, and I just love this. I love cupcakes. I mean, that's my favorite dessert. <laughs> love, love, love cupcakes. So when I saw this cupcake, I had to have it. And I knew exactly what I wanted to use with it. And this is the Tim Holtz um, Sewing Room embossing folders. I used that um, for my, my part of my challenge. I colored the cupcake with, um, with my Copics. I pop dot the frosting and the button on dimensionals. It just gave it, you know, a, a pretty cool dimensional look. Um, this paper here, I believe Yvonne Scrap Bliss sent me in um, a rack, and I thought it went perfect with this theme. Um, and I kind of pulled the colors from the paper onto the uh, cupcake itself. Added some buttons and ran some um, twine through it, some lace and. Um, some of this beaded trim that Divine gave me. Hey Divine! Um, if you're watching, <laughs> I know you're busy. <laughs> um, and then I use my Spellbinders, um, oh gosh I can't remember, it's a sewing um, Spellbinders set and this is the spool that I um, um, cut out and I used Stephanie's um, sentiment at a little treat for someone so sweet. And I just love how this card came together. And it's a 5x5 five five card. And this is an A2 card, regular size card. So that was one week. Um, this week was one of these. Oh, I can't. One of the challenges before um, is a shaped card. And um, the sponsor was Creative Bug on the Loose and this is the image that I colored and cut it out with my I think it was, it was my um, Fiskars circle die cutting thing I still use that thing I don't know why I guess because some of my circle templates are in storage so I have to use what I have on hand um, so I colored her up with my Copics I added this flower that I made um, a couple, mm, yeah, it was a couple weeks ago. I made these um, zipper flowers with pearls, and it it just went with the paper that I used. And this paper, I believe, gosh, I can't remember, is the Love Me My 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 Mind's Eye stack. These are little teeny tiny butterflies that I used and added some bling, and it's an easel card. And I used Stephanie's stamp here, fluttering by to say hi, and some more butterflies, and then the paper inside. So that's my easel card that I made. And then my last card is this one. And this one was for um, a challenge, um, pastel colors. Now, the paper is pastel, <laughs> believe me, it is. And this image, this really pretty image, is from Becky's Place. And um, I colored her again with my Copics. Added some glitter glue to the centers of the flowers. Um, here's Sweet Friend is Stephanie's sentiment stamp. I use a Spellbinder flower um, die. And then these are just... Um, Stampin' Up Trio flowers, and I added some flat back pearl and some gems. And then um, this is an EK Success punch, I believe. I don't think it's the Martha Stewart one, but I think it's the EK Success one. Added more pearls here, layered a lot of pastel color um, cardstock, and um, this is a punch from Stampin' Up as well. The scallop circle and the small oval card. And I think I didn't put anything in the sun, in the inside of the card, but that's my last card that I wanted to share with you all. 
Hope everybody's having a great week. Um, hopefully I'll be back with another, well, a couple projects um, for a special announcement. So I will be back later. So thanks everyone for watching and have a great day. Bye.